<sighs> well, good afternoon and evening, everyone. This is Tara Quator. Welcome to Monday. It's Monday, September 23rd, 2024, day 267. Oh no, I hope I don't fall. Give it a little bit of a pause for your little sound bite. Probably, probably longer than I needed, but anyway. It is a somewhat dull Monday, uh, which, which I guess you could say is kind of normal. Um, before I get into it, uh, I'm a little bit dizzy at the moment for two reasons. One, this world has so many particles that my headset can't keep up, so it's, uh, it's a little dizzying to move around in here. I tried looking for one of the new and noteworthy worlds, and... One of them required that you use one of their public avatars, and it looked horrible. But the other reason why I'm a little out of it right now, and a bit dizzy, is I'm short of breath. Yeah, but uh, that's because Buttercup brought home a sickness again. Her throat's been sore. And for me, it feels like uh, whatever sickness it was, it's trying to go straight into my chest right now. So I'm just doing the typical things to avoid it getting into my chest. Because, you know, I don't want that. <sighs> But I don't look forward to this sickness at all because sore throats are obnoxious. But not a whole lot else to talk about because, like I said, Buttercup stayed home today because of being sick. So it's mainly just been everyone resting today. Everyone was resting, kind of. Really, um, I'm trying to, f yeah, we all we all just. We were all resting. Sweet Pea was not happy about that, though. She wanted to do things today. Kind of limited on what you can do when people are getting sick, you know? But, can't complain. Well, I, I can complain there. What am I talking about? There, unfortunately, there's not a whole lot else. However, there is one big thing, kind of big thing, is that um, one of the houses near my mother-in-law uh, one of the houses near here it just went onto the went up on the housing market for sale for like it's a three bedroom house for like thirty seven thousand. I know it sounds weird, but some houses out here are like really really cheap. But the thing is, I don't even know if we have. I don't even know if we'd qualify for the federal loans or anything like that. So it's worth looking into, but I don't expect much out of it. So. As soon as it was, I was as soon as it was mentioned, I I, I wish my, my mother-in-law didn't mention it over the phone in discussion with my kids around because now Buttercup is only talk, thinking about having that house when I don't even think we can afford it. But so now she's she was going on about it for like two hours. <sighs> I'd like to be able to afford a house. That'd be fantastic. But. Our situation, I can't even afford a car. I can't even afford driving a car, so. Like, I can't afford buying it, let alone afford the insurance, fuel, and everything like that. We don't make much. <laughs> Some people are like, but you have VR. It's like, yeah, this was a one-time investment, and it unfortunately hasn't really gone the way I originally hoped when I did that. But it's fine. Kind of. But it's, it's not like... You know, some people like, we'll just get rid of it. It's like, yeah, getting rid of things only helps a temp, like, helps a temporary situation, not a long term. We're in a long term situation, you know? But that's how things go. I know a lot of people in similar situations to ours. And unfortunately, the, uh, the number of people I know in this kind of situation just keeps growing. But I don't want to go on about that because it's really depressing. Oh, dizzying. Feels like it's just getting worse in here. Woof. 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 I don't woof. But I, I, I'm just keeping this one brief today because, like I said, I am short of breath right now. I got to worry about making sure there's plenty of tea available. Hot tea. I did. I did have some uh, some dandelion tea last night. Uh, I. I doubled it up just to make sure it was strong enough to actually, you know, taste. But unfortunately, I don't think I can have that one, so I'll leave the rest of it for Lily if she wants to have 
dandelion tea because it kind of made my throat itchy. So there's a possibility I might have a small allergy to dandelion. So I'm not going to continue that risk. That's the first time I've had a tea where my throat felt itchy. So I'm like, you know, yeah, that might not be the best idea for me to be having. <sighs> Those fish floating in the air. It's throwing me off. Although, really, what's really throwing me off are all the particles out here. It should be, like, I should be able to handle it. I've made some adjustments. It still wasn't enough. <sighs> It must be the weird optimization of VR chat. Gotta love it. I think they have more optimization for mobile than they do PC, but that's because PC you can get away with a lot more. Like having decent shaders. Eh, there isn't a whole lot for me to a whole lot else for me to talk about other than I'm hoping we can come up with something to get that house. And if I have to, Tessa and I will go into streaming as often as we can just to try making our way toward that but then that would mean busting our butts and honestly if i were to be completely honest streaming is just stressful you'd think doing these videos can be stressful but they're not streaming is stressful and well any kind of job can be but streaming for us in particular is a stressful endeavor and i, I guess part of it is we're just not uh, streaming requires you know socializing and that's something I haven't really done for a while. Like, even on here, I seldom ever talk with other people. It's mainly just me talking to you, the camera, and then going about my day. So I, I don't really, I mean, I, I can even look on here. There are even people I remember talking to. And someone just fell in the living room. I felt that on I felt that in on the floor. Let's see. Who the heck names themselves Evil Twink? Let's see, Bayumi. I don't remember talking with them. Let's see. It's also hard to scroll for me right now. It's kind of dizzying. Don't remember you. Don't remember you. Yeah, no one I really remember are on right now so I wouldn't be able to even try socializing because most of the people that are on my list right now I'm I'm sorry I don't remember you that's my fault but if, but again when I really started VR chat back in 2019 and a little bit of 2020 was when we were most active and uh, 2021 is when we started falling out completely and that was because we drank too much. We we did a lot of drinking in VR chat. Nowhere near the degree of a few people we used to know. Like, um, I think it would be fair that I don't bring names up. It, that that's just trying to be fair. But there are a few people that we knew that drank a lot, a lot, and I thought I drank too much. Of course, I still think I drank too much, but. I didn't drink like that. I still felt horrible and it was affecting my ability to socialize. So that's why I stopped because it was it was ruining my ability to do. It ruined my do whatever. I don't know. Anyway, I uh I really don't want to keep this going much longer. I am not feeling well right now. I'm getting a few other things in the terms of not feeling well that'll need to be taken care of post haste. Don't ask. Anyway, this is Terraquator. It's it's a Monday. The family's all getting sick. I'm not feeling well. There's a lot on my mind that need taken care of. I have other things I need to take care of before I can even think about making supper in a little bit. So I'm going to take care of those. Please enjoy your Monday, September 23rd, 2024. Day 267 in the year. Oh, man. This, this year has gone by a lot. For being sober, this 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 year's going by a lot faster than I had expected for being, a, you know, sober. I thought it was just going to take forever. But here we are. Things are going just fine. But anyway, y'all take care of yourselves. 
We'll see you tomorrow. I'm out because I don't feel good. Oh boy, do I not feel well.